Hey, Sandra, Luis, how are you? Fine, teacher, thanks, and you? I'm doing pretty good. How was your day today? Very, very, very tired. <laughs> ah, okay. A lot of work. Yes, yes. Very much work. What, what do you do, Sandra? Um, I... <laughs> Y me perdí, me ponchó, teacher. No, 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 it's okay. I put in the chat, I put in the chat. Relax. Yo cuido una anciana, pero la vez pasada, aquí lo anoté, como yo se decía. You are a nurse, Sandra? Yes. A nurse? Yes, I nurse. Okay. I am nurse. Excellent, Sandra. And you nurse with in the hospital, in the private nurse, in the clinic, for salud, minsal. Um, sería particular, como casa particular, sería como private. privada. Yes, correct, a private nurse. Oh, a, a private nurse. 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 Yeah. Nurse. 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 Excellent. Okay. Good. So in this moment, partners, this is what we're going to do. We are going to talk to our partner about today. What do you do? Where did you work? And then ask more WH questions. Remember WH questions. What, for example, what? Where, how, when, why. The important is ask WH questions with our partners. You ready? Ready, teacher. Excellent. Okay. Ahí sería, eh, bueno, la, hay veces la... la La cuido parcialmente y ahora me toca cuidarla desde miércoles hasta sábado, porque okay. la familia ha salido. Sería prime time, vea. Part time. Part time. Part time. Correct. Okay. Okay. Let's go with our partners and begin the conversation. Okay. Hi, Mel, Nady, Walter, what happened? Let me send you an invitation to join the group. Good evening, teacher. Good evening, good evening. Let's try another invitation for the group. Griselda is the invitation to join the group.
Any questions? Okay, we're ready. Santos, tell me about your partner. Good night, everybody. Good night. Hello, hello, Santos. Night. Tell us about your partner, Santos. Okay. Uh, excuse me, my microphone is <laughs> in silencio. <laughs> okay, my my partner is Dora Lisa. Uh, she studied English for New Yaunisa. Uh, in other country as you go uh, oh, only no, on okay um, okay no problem no problem little by little it's okay <laughs> it's good okay relax uh, relax and it's good um, okay. Yes. okay erasmo tell me about your partner Excuse me, uh, my partner is uh, Luis Monson. Tell me about Luis. Yes. Explain Luis. What what did Luis do? Um, eh, no comprendo, disculpe. Okay, no problem, no problem. Yeah. Uh, is this, explain Luis. Now, what activity did Luis do today? Uh, yes, um, uh, it's a um, 
uh, your, your working uh, is an uh, engineer um, industrial. Okay. Yeah. Okay. No. Uh, um, your, your live is um, a Wachapan. Okay. He lives. He works. He lives. He lives. Exactly. Okay. Good. Listo. Thank you, Erasmo. Excellent. Okay. okay. Eso es la introducción del tema de hoy. Hoy vamos a estar viendo yes. el pasado. El pasado. Y el pasado es tan común así, que es día a día. ¿Qué hiciste? ¿Dónde fuiste? ¿Qué comiste? Es común. Eso es lo que vamos a ver hoy. ¿Ok? Ok. ¿Alguien okay. sabe algo del pasado? Al, eh, la estructura o algo de los verbos o... ¿Tiene algún conocimiento previo del pasado? Teacher. Yes, yes. De bueno. mm, past, the past eh, le añadimos el ed, ed ah, excellent. a los verbos. Good, the regular verbs, excellent. Regular verbs. Is ed okay? Sure. I I learned the past verb. I I use was and were uh, for verb to be. Okay, good. The verb to be in the past was and were. Excellent. Y alguien sabe o ha escuchado cómo hacemos preguntas en el pasado? How we make questions in the past? Teacher, eh, cuando um, agregamos el, el did, did, uh, did you work in, no sé. Yes. Ok, ok. Ok. Nice. So, it's good. For example, like Erasmus said, did you work? Okay, for example, did you work yesterday? This is the past, excellent. So it's correct, all is correct. Today we're going to learn more information for the past. First, let's listen and read a conversation. Here is the first conversation. Hi to all, welcome to section seven. We had a great time. In this session, participants will listen to a conversation between two people and the activities they did last weekend. This conversation will walk us through activities that took place in the past. I really need you to concentrate as we'll begin to study simple past. As you listen to the conversation, write down all the verbs in the past you can identify. Did you do anything special? So, what did you do last weekend, Meg? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sounds like fun. Did you go to Lucky's? No, we didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just stayed home and studied for today's Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today? I forgot all about that. Don't worry. You always get an A. Ah, okay. Hi to all. Welcome to First, Sex in the Past. Let's look at the vocabulary. Okay. Any vocabulary you don't know or don't understand? No. The vocabulary is okay? Anywhere. Anywhere. Any place. Any location. Is anywhere. Mm -hmm. Donde sea. Excellent. Repeat. Downtown. 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 
la ciudad. Uh -huh. El centro. Okay. This is downtown. And forgot? No remember. It's forgot. Um. It's not remember. Here. Okay. I forgot. Olvidar. Correct. Olvidar, not remember. Forget, forgot. Mm -hmm. It's okay. Ok, miremos aquí un poquito. ¿Cuáles son las palabras que usan para las preguntas en el pasado? El uso del did. No, did, no. exactly. Did, did, did. Ajá. Uh -huh. Mucho con did. Y cuando hacemos la pregunta con did, ¿cómo va a ir el verbo? ¿Cómo está la, el verbo con did? The form of base form. Present. The base form. Present. Form of base. Did you? And the base form. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. In the answer, the answer, the verb in the past. We went. Okay. I stayed. Right. Okay. Always in the past. So in this moment, we're going to practice with a partner. My partner is Rick and I am Meg. And we practiced with the partner. ¿Cuál es el objetivo? El objetivo con el compañero es hacer la conversación en 30 segundos. ¿En cuánto tiempo? 30 segundos. 30 segundos. 30 seconds. 30 seconds. Correct. 30 seconds. Lo vamos a practicar dos veces. Yo voy a hacer una vez. Rick, my partner Meg. Then I Meg, my partner Rick. Ok. 30 segundos es la meta. Okay. This only three minutes. You ready? Yes. Yes. Okay. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. So, what did you do last weekend, Meg? Oh, I. Ya terminó el tiempo. Go, 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 go. Oh, I had a great time. I went to karaoke bar and sang, and sang with some friends on Saturday. That sound like fun. Did you go to Lucky's? No. We didn't. We went to that new place downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just studied home and studied for today Spanish test. Our Spanish test is today. I forgot all about that. Don't worry, you always get an eye. So, what did you do last weekend, man? Oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sat with some friends.
Okay, let's see. Jaime, you had a question? Jaime, do you have a question? Pronunciation. It's okay. It's okay? No, no question, teacher. It's okay. It's okay. The, the conversation. Okay. All right. Let's take a look. Okay. So let's see. Jaime, select one person. Select one person. Okay. Uh, don't Santos Santos Okay Don Santos sí Okay I'm ready Okay So Santos and let's see Rosa Esmeralda Okay Santos and Rosa Esmeralda Let's practice the conversation. 30 seconds. Okay. okay. Yes. Okay. I'm I am Rick. Okay. Okay. So that did that did you do last weekend, May? Oh, I had get at time. I went to karaoke bar and they say we sung friends on Saturday. That so like fun. Did you go to the go to Lucas? No, we didn't. We went to to the new place. Dawson. How about how about you? Did you go anywhere? Okay. No. 30 seconds. Oh, hasta allí llegó los 30 segundos. Ok, vamos, oh, vamos. Okay. <laughs> no okay. worry, no worry. Vamos al siguiente grupo. ¿Quién puede? All right. Select the next group. Who's next, son? Who's the next partner? Me. Who's me? The next, the next one? Um, Griselda. Ok, Griselda. Okay, Griselda and Steve. And who? Griselda yes. and? Griselda and Ciro. Okay, Griselda and Ciro. Okay, Griselda, what did you do last weekend? Okay. Uh, oh, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. That's on live fun. Did you go to Lotus? No, we didn't. We went to that never place. Downtown. How about you? Did you go anywhere? No, I didn't go anywhere all weekend. I just stay home at the study for today. Okay. Casi, casi lo logran. Uh, un poquito más. 30 seconds, 30 seconds. Ok. Acuérdense, pronunciación, equipo, es great, great time. Great time. Y el verbo es sang. Sang. Ok. Ciro, el, el último persona, le dije, ¿quién es? ¿Quién es? Erasmo. All right, Erasmo. ¿Y quién más? Uh, Erasmo en Silvia. Ok, Erasmo en Silvia. Esto, Silvia, Silvia, okay. what did you do last weekend? Oh, I, I had a great time. I went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends on Saturday. The song like fun, did you go to Lucas? No, we no. We went to the new place, Dalton. How about you? Did you go anywhere? I No, I didn't go to 
anywhere I weekends. I just study ham. Oh, um, there so. we go, right there. Oof, casi, ahí vamos. <laughs> good job, yes, good yes. job. Okay. Y eso es la meta. La meta es estar cada vez empujándose que lo hagan más y más rápido, fluidos. No quieren acostumbrarse a so, what did you do la... No, porque no van a hablar así. Así que no se vayan acostumbrando a estar leyendo así. Porque si se acostumbran así, después se les hace bien difícil tener la fluidez, ¿ok? Uh, good. Let's continue. We have now irregular and regular verbs. ¿Alguien se acuerda? What is irregular and regular? Do you remember the difference? The regular verb no change. Correct. The regular verbs no change. No change. Only ed. Only ed. Yeah, ed. 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 Excellent. The, the, the regular verb change the structure of the verb. Good. The irregular. Okay, let's watch the video and learn. In this session, simple past questions and answers will be introduced. Irregular and regular verbs will also be taught. Welcome back. So now it's time to study past tense. For us to succeed learning it, we need to learn verbs in simple past. We'll teach you how to make questions and how to answer in both affirmative and negative form. Please pay attention. Simple past. Did you work on Saturday? Yes, I did. I worked all day. No, I didn't. I didn't work at all. Did you go anywhere last weekend? Yes, I did. I went to the movies. No, I didn't. I didn't go anywhere. What did Rick do on Saturday? He stayed home and studied for a test. How did Meg spend her weekend? She went to a karaoke bar and sang with some friends. Let's talk about questions in simple past. Did you realize the auxiliary we used? Did. We use auxiliary did for questions and short answers, positive and negative. Did you realize what happened to the question after we used did? See the next example. Did you go to the beach? Did he break the window? In each question, the verb is used in simple present because we use did. It is not correct to say, did you went to the beach? Did he broke the window? So remember, every time you ask a question in simple past, you need to use the auxiliary did and the main verb goes back to present. For short answers in affirmative and negative in simple past, we must use did within the answer as we saw on the chart. Yes, I did. No, I didn't. This takes us to say that we use verbs in simple past when we say affirmative sentences. Take a look at the following statements. They went to the park last weekend. I woke up late this morning. She came late to class. I suggest for you to study and learn verbs in simple past for you to express past activities and experiences. Okay. So what is the important, the important always that we use here, like the example. In the questions we use did and did. Okay, since si tenemos la pregunta did, la respuesta is yes or no. Pero si tenemos how, what, where, why, did, then the sentence, the answer. It's an answer for the sentence, okay? So, as example, I say to Walter, Walter, did you eat pupusas today? What is the answer for Walter? Yes, I did. Yes, I did. Or, no, I didn't. I didn't. Okay. Es diferente si yo le pregunto a Walter, Walter, what did you eat today? And the answer? I ate pupusas de frijoles. I ate pupusas, right? It's different. No yes or no. It's now 
a sentence. Okay. Because uh, because that yes, questions are into into the information. All right. So what are the questions that we have? Is very normal to have questions. For example, what, uh, where, when, why, okay, how, who. What else do we use for it? When? Mm -hmm. Okay, place. Oh, okay. 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 En el chat pueden ver cómo hacemos algunas preguntas. ¿Qué usamos? What. ¿Qué significa what? ¿Qué? ¿Qué? Exacto. Si no saben, anótenlo. ¿Qué? ¿El where? ¿Dónde? 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 Excelente. ¿Why? ¿Por qué? ¿Por qué? ¿Qué? Excelente. ¿Por qué? ¿How? ¿Cómo? 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 ¿Who? ¿Quién? 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 ¿Y when? ¿Cuándo? 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 Ok. Así que si yo empiezo la pregunta, hey, imagínense que Dora es mi, mi compañera, yo le digo, Dora, how are you? I'm fine, thank you. And you? I'm fine, thank you. Dora, what did you do today? Uh, today I went to visit my family. Oh, where did you go? Where did you visit your family? I visit my family in Ciudad Delgado. Oh, why did you visit your family? Because my mother is sick. Oh, and how did you go to visit your family? In, um, in car, in Uber, uh, in taxi? I visit my mom in car in car, okay? And who, and, y ahí vas, ahí está la conversación. Solo estoy usando lo que me dijo mi compañera o compañero para continuar haciendo más y más preguntas y respuestas. It's okay? It's okay. Yes. 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 Voy a proyectar okay. una vez más okay. para, para que les quede claro cómo podemos hacerlas aquí. Las estructuras. Ah, what did, si estoy hablando con alguien directo, what did you do on Saturday? How did you spend your weekend? What? Y así vamos, solo es una conversación de qué es lo que hicieron hoy, ayer, lo que quiera. ¿Ok? Ok. En el chat ven que hay seis diferentes, ¿verdad? What, where, why, how, who, when. Tienen que hacer por lo menos cuatro diferentes preguntas. ¿Cuántas? Cuatro. Cuatro. Four. Four. Four different questions. Four different questions with your partner. You ready? Ready, teacher. Yes. Okay. Four and four. Four and four. Sorry, let's recreate. Mm. Okay, let's try again, let's try again, sorry. Hello. Hello. Hi. Hi. Oscar, Walter, you okay? Dora? I don't have partner in my breakout room. Yo creo que Walter, Oscar, que no se unieron, no sé por qué. 
All okay. right. See, si, Walter, Walter, okay. I put you to another room, no problem, Dora. Okay, thank you. You're welcome. Oscar, what happened? What happened, Oscar? Walter, what happened? Walter, what happened? Oh, the teacher, hasta ahorita me dejó entrar. Uh -huh. Okay. Bueno, ni modo, a veces el Inter nos cuesta, la plataforma cuesta cargar, ¿verdad? Okay, no problem. Sí, sí porque en, en, en la sala pequeña estaba cuando de repente me apareció que había habido un error y me sacó. Mm. Y no me quería cargar. Okay. Ok, pero ¿entendiste cómo se hacen las preguntas, Walter? Sí, sí, sí. Sí, lo, lo que me cuesta un poquito es con el vocabulario porque trato de aprenderme las, las palabras y, y se me olvidan. Pero sí, 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 sí entendí cómo se maneja. Ok, excelente, excelente. Uh -huh. Ok, let's see. Ahora bien, ¿verdad de que, de que se ocupa el, eh, eh, um, las, seis, las seis palabras que nos dio cuando son respuestas largas? Correct. Así es, ¿verdad? Correct. Así es, así es. El y what, cuando ve la auxiliar, es respuesta corta. Correcto. So I said, yes, yes I did, no I didn't, y ya. Ok, 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 entonces sí. Pero la estructura siempre es lo mismo. 
Va a ser, uh -huh. por ejemplo, what did you eat, study, work, play? Y siempre va a ser la, la misma orden. Uh -huh. Ok, ok. Ok. Y verdad que cuando acompañamos, el o sea, cuando va el auxiliar, el verbo va en presente. Correcto. Así es, ¿verdad? Correcto. Ok. Así es. Okay, okay. Siempre que Teacher. va el auxiliar, ahí va. Yeah. Teacher, una pregunta. El compañero me estaba preguntando qué hice yo el sábado, pero yo estaba enferma. Pero sería la pregunta, why do you sick, ¿verdad? No, 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 no. El why, ¿qué ¿alguien se acuerda qué significa why? Es por qué. ¿Por qué? <coughs> Ajá, pero él me estaba preguntando por qué me enfermé. Pero, ¿cómo formularíamos la pregunta? Ah, bueno, ahí sí, ¿por qué te enfermaste? Si es correcto, Ajá. why. Ahí, ok. Why did you get sick? Do you get <coughs> Ah, get sick, ok. Uh -huh. Entonces yo le contesté, we don't change. <laughs> the, el que change? Weather. Weather change. Eh. <clears throat> de clima. El cambio de clima, ajá, uh -huh. ok. Yes. Weather. Weather. Correct. Weather. Weather. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> ok. Excellent. ¿Alguien más? Dance teacher. You're welcome, Sandra. Any other questions? No? Se sienten preparados? Que les quedó claro cuando usamos did, como el verbo? Yes? Yes, teacher. Ah, so, ok, entonces vamos yes. a hacer diferentes parejas. Sí. En la plataforma 2.4, 2.4, vamos a poner en práctica, a ver si de verdad entendimos bien. Tienen 10 preguntas y tienen que elegir qué es lo correcto. ¿Cuál es la forma correcta para hacer esas, um, completar esa pregunta o esa oración? ¿Ok? With the partners. Ok. Let's try. Luis, you okay? Oscar, you okay? Luis Oscar. Oscar, you okay?
Oscar, any questions? Oscar, ¿qué pasó? Hola, de, I'm sorry, I lose the connection. Ah, okay, okay, Oscar, no problem, no problem. Sometimes it happens, no, relax. Okay. But now it's okay, Oscar? Yes, by now it's okay. Okay. All right, let's try together. You ready? Yes. Excellent. I am ready. Okay, Oscar, number one. Did you stay home on Saturday? Did you stay home on Saturday? Okay. Thank you. All right. Number two, number two. Who's number two? No, I didn't. Say draw. No, I didn't. I didn't call. Call draw. Yes. Okay. Call draw. Okay. Read the sentence. Read the sentence. Go ahead. No, I didn't, my friend. I didn't call. I didn't call. I didn't call, my friend. My friend. Mm -hmm. We drove to a coffee for lunch. Correct, cafe. Okay, good. Walter, number three. Um, did you spend? Read that. Read How the question. Three. How did you spend? How did you spend your last birthday? Okay, all right. Roxana, number four. I have a party. Everyone did it like the amount noise. It bad the neighbor. Ah, perdón, I did it like the noise. I know, yes. Okay. Uh -huh. okay. <laughs> Enjoy, enjoy it. So, okay, repeat again, which, what is the correct answer? The second one. I have a party, everyone, and, ¿cómo se pronuncia, perdón? Enjoy it. Enjoyed. Enjoy it, but the neighbor, did it like the noise? Okay. All right. Good. All right. Let's see. Number five. Who's number five? Number five? Rosa Esmeralda. Um, what did, did you do last night? Okay. Good. All right. And number six. Sonia. Uh, 
eh, sería eh, the last one. Read it, read it, Sonia. Léelo, Sonia. Uh, I went uh, today Sonia uh, I went to the gym uh, new gym um, Sonia yeah. Sonia, Sonia, Sonia. Teacher. Sí. Sonia. Sí, teacher. Ajá, es que lo, que, lo seguí poniendo en silencio. Solo léelo, Sonia. Uh, I went today a new gym a refill. I I got I I went love. Ya usaste went al principio, entonces sería solo I loved it. I loved. It. Excellent, Sonia. Very good. Navy number seven. Good job, Sonia. Um. Sería. Did you did you do anything special over the weekend? Okay, Nady, thank you. Luis, number eight. What is number eight, Luis? Seria, uh, did you sing at the party? Read the sentence, Luis. Go ahead. Uh, Seria, uh -huh. uh -huh. yes. I I did. Yes, I did. I I went shopping. Um, ¿Cómo se pronuncia la siguiente palabra? Un for Un, unfortunately. Unfortunately, I spent I spent all my money. No, I am broke. Brooke. Excellent. All right. Good. Good. Okay. Let's see. Silvia, number nine. Did you sing at the party? Okay. Did you sing at the party? No party. 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 No, no part. Party. Party. There you go, excellent party. And party. Dora, number 10. No, I didn't. I was sick. The okay, number... no, I... mm -hmm. ¿Cuál de las tres didn't? First. The first. Okay. Woo! Excellent. Very good. All of those answers are correct. Okay. Y así es como tenemos que usar todo el did y el didn't y siempre did que usamos el auxiliar el verbo en presente ok it's ok ok it's ok 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 excelente ok ahora qué vamos a hacer con el compañero vamos a ver qué aprendimos desde el lunes van a explicarle qué vimos qué es lo que entendieron ya terminamos la unidad 1 qué aprendieron de la 1 qué se acuerdan ¿Qué vimos? ¿Qué vimos el lunes? ¿Qué vimos el martes? Hoy ya es miércoles. Hoy ya estamos en otro tema. Otra unidad. ¿Qué vimos? What did we learn? Unit one, unit two. Y eso podemos usar lo de hoy. What? What did we learn? Right? Ok. Entonces, por ejemplo, con Silvia. Yo y Silvia, mi compañera. Ah. Silvia, ¿qué aprendimos? What did we learn on Monday?
Okay, maybe Sylvia's sleeping. Ya quedó roncando Silvia. All right, Silvia, no problem. Okay. Sandra, what did we learn, Sandra? Uh, es, estábamos hablando acerca de uh, do you often, sometimes, can begin in sentences. Eh, okay. <coughs> how often do you exercise? Uh, complete sentences, partner. Correct. How often? The frequency. Excellent. Excellent. Okay. Y así, what else did we learn? ¿Qué aprendimos el martes? What did we learn Tuesday? Yesterday, what did you learn? Uh, what, what did you do? How often? Um, the different forms to use the how, how often, how long, how well. Uh huh, very good. Excellent. How, right? Y como se usa cada how. Yesterday. Excellent. Okay. Así que, muy fácil. Podemos hacer preguntas, respuestas, frecuencia, pasado, todo. Ya podemos tener una conversación. Le puedo decir, what did you do? Uh, I visited my mother. Y ya desde ayer aprendimos, hey, qué tan frecuente visitar a tu mamá. Qué tan seguido vas a la playa. ¿Qué tal? Ese es el how, right? Con lo de hoy. Ok. What did you do? Where did you eat? What? Ok. Le voy a dar un ejemplo. Por ejemplo, con Dora. Normal. Dora, what did you eat for lunch? For lunch, I ate chicken and beans and tortillas. Chicken and beans and tortillas. And how often do you eat chicken? Uh, twice a week. Exactly. You see, easy conversation. Dora, continua. Dale. Conversation. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, what do you do yesterday? ¿A, a quién le vas a preguntar? Uh, Jaime. A Jaime, ok, me llega. All right. Jaime, hasta ya listo okay. para. Ya, ya casi son las 10. <laughs> ya casi. No, ok, Jaime, go, go, go. Bien. The question. Mm -hmm. What did you do yesterday? Yesterday, I I went to work and and, and then in the night uh, studying English with partner at, at night nine o'clock okay. nine p.m. o'clock. Okay. Why do you? Go for study English. Ok, está bien, guay. Pero practiquemos lo que vimos ayer. How. Okay. Acordate qué tipo de how puedes hacer diferente. How. Ok. How long eh, do you practice English every day? Ok. I practice English and uh, listen music and, and YouTube. Ah, pero esa no era la pregunta, Ajá. porque no era how, solo how, eran dos partes. Dora, repeat the question, repeat the question, Dora. Ok, how long do you study or practice English, English every day? I practice English, I practice English en, en horario de clase. Ah, ok, for one hour, for one hour, ok. okay. Okay. Uh, yes. Why is mm -hmm. Jaime? Why is your goal for the study English today and the future? Oh. <laughs> Ahí sí ya ya nos funcionó, verdad, Jaime? Ahí está. <laughs> okay. For, for the future, for the sorry, for the future is the. I, I let a, a conversation de manera fluida. <laughs> ah, excellent, excellent. Ok, good. Y eso es lo, la idea. La idea es que nosotros estemos practicando, utilizando todos los días. Tenemos que hacer el esfuerzo para usar lo que hemos visto. Porque si no, se nos va a ir olvidando. Y después, 
solo lo, a, lo acordamos que lo vimos, pero no lo podemos usar, ¿ok? Ok, así que la unidad 1 deben de tener terminada en la plataforma y mañana continuamos. Ok, good night, see you tomorrow. Good night. 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 Good night.